I wanted to vlog this week because it's about to be the holidays and it's finals and everything's nuts, but now I have the flu. But I want to show you that my professor bought me my favorite donut and I'm gonna attack it. He actually bought me two, which is super dangerous. But only one at a time. But he got me donuts. Grad school for the win. And I just finished my take home final for him. Yes. I'm obsessed with this punky screamo cover of Endgame. I've been obsessed with Endgame, period. Can't stop listening to this. So our fall decor up. <laughs> My thoughts, paranoia, and insecurities. Can't do this part. <laughs> High school me is coming out. That's why I don't vlog. I don't wanna miss you. Like me, other girls do. I don't wanna touch you. I just wanna be drinking on a beach with you all over me. They all say, I ain't trying to play. I wanna be your end game. I wanna be your first string. This is why I have no robotic memory cards ever. I thought the words were big reputation, but he said bad. Ooh, I like some big enemies. Ooh, this is by. Who's this by? I don't know why I haven't turned on any lights in my apartment. It's by Windwalkers and Mark Prom. Yes, Prom. Swear I don't love the drama. He loves me. Hi everyone. Sorry if that intro terrified you. Is this Vlogmas? I really just want to do a December vlog. I have been wanting to vlog. I wanted to start like a week ago, a week and a half ago, and do like finals. I don't know what about this time of year, the end of the semester always makes me want to vlog and do Christmas stuff. And it's kind of like my half-assed vlogmas because I can't do every day. I can't do every week. I kind of did every week last year. Go check those out on my vlog channel. I don't know which one this one's going on. You know by now because you're watching it. Um, <laughs> I hope you do. But I really wanted to vlog for the past week and just talk about all the things that are going on. It's my first final season in grad school, so it was bonkers, guys. I feel like a whole new person now that they're pretty much over. Um, but I got the freaking flu. I got through finals with the flu. Um, what's today? Saturday? A week ago, I couldn't move. I couldn't move for two days and I had to call out of work a bunch of days. I had to go give a presentation a couple days after I just came down with it and I thought I was going to pass out during it because um, whenever I would stand up, I would just get so dizzy and it was awful and super scary and my boyfriend had to go get me medicine and a heating pad like in the middle of snow. It wasn't that bad. They made it sound like it was one of those big snowstorms. But it snowed more yesterday, okay? And no one gave a crap. They didn't make a big deal about it. So it was just very dramatic because there was the snow. He had to go out and get me stuff and I was like dying. <laughs> but I got over it pretty quick. So today I'm on the way to a Christmas party. I have to find a gift swap gift. I just found out about, and I'm going to a Christmas party tomorrow too, and I'm so excited. So I wanted to vlog with you. I'm wearing pajamas, I'm sorry, pajama vlogs. Hello. And just walking around in my house in the full face of makeup and lipstick. I haven't worn like bright lipstick like this in forever and it feels so festive and fun. So it's finally time for me to get into Christmas mode. I always compartmentalize. I don't like let myself do Christmassy things until finals are over. Otherwise I'll never focus on finals. So my economics exam is over. That was the scariest one. I just have one take home. Um, that I don't think it's gonna be too bad. So I'm so excited. I feel free. I feel like a whole new person. I'm like healthier and um, mostly healthy, I think, I hope. And finals are over so I can actually breathe and have some free time and get to go have a social life again. So I feel like for the past two weeks I've just been studying and doing presentations and constantly so stressed out. Um, so I wanted to vlog during that so it wasn't just me sitting here catching you up But also I want to catch you up because so much has been happening and I just haven't been able to show it So right now I'm packing I really need to hit the road and actually put some real people clothes on but all my Christmassy sweaters are at home I think I'm going straight there So like I don't have time to find a Christmassy sweater, so I might just wear a flannel 
but I saw a picture of myself in it and it like didn't look as flattering in pictures as I thought. So in case this is a photo opportunity, do I wanna wear that? Uh, I just wore the same American Eagle flannel for two days in a row because it's so cozy. My hair's in a messy bun, by the way. Can't really. In case it looks like I don't have hair right now. <laughs> And like a messy bun so it feels so good to do my makeup again just wake up and do a full face so yes i gotta go um i think i'm pretty much packed just have to figure out what i'm wearing i don't know i'll like get all ready to go but then the clothes always trip me up and i'm like what do i wear oh my god so i feel like there are more things i wanted to catch you up on but i will suppose i'll do that later on what is today it's already december 16th that's insane uh pff, what so yeah i'm basically almost halfway done i need to finish that one take home and then i'm halfway done with my freaking degree i'm so excited that sounds so cool to say ah for my makeup in case you're wondering i'm liking how i did my brows i use my brow whiz this is never petal down lip liner by wet and wild underneath bad habit ColourPop Ultra Matte Lip, and then I just use some of the lighter colors from the Naked 2 palette. It's a cool tone one. I have it like beauty vlogged in so long I forgot, so they're kind of purpley pink. And then I actually used, oh, that looks so creepy, oh my god, eh. Um, I used this face highlighter from Makeup Revolution that's really pretty sparkly pink color on my inner corners and on the lid as well. I don't know why I've never thought to do that because I always want something kind of sparkly glowy there but sometimes it's too intense to use on your face as a highlighter unless you're going out somewhere at night um and also i use my wet and wild setting spray and i got it in my eye and i was crying and i was like i'm gonna ruin my makeup as soon as i do it and it hurt so bad so if this eye looks a little funny that's why i think i mostly fixed it okay we've blabbered enough also my hair got re Redified over Thanksgiving and it looked really really good for a while. It's still okay I've been washing it in cold water and trying to take really good care of it like more than usual And so I think it's looking pretty good especially in this lighting. Yeah All right, go get dressed out. Well, that only took a painful amount of time, but we're ready I have my tote bag from Bass that was in my Black Friday haul if you saw that you should check it out and then this duffel bag from pink this was like a freebie if you spent like a ton of money on their pink friday event which was not black friday it was like over the summer it was so much fun i don't think i ever hauled it but i've been using this a ton it just it fits so much and i feel like i'm always packing up and jumping in my car so this has been absolutely perfect and it just holds everything it's so easy to carry but it doesn't get too heavy so ta -da. i'm making one last coffee for the road i've been obsessed with this one lately normally i'm not a flavored coffee person this was on sale at target the archer farms apple cider donut coffee it's so good so i'm gonna make another one of these to go my little vera bradley mug and the bottom part is recyclable you can take out the top and recycle the bottom which is great yay environment so yeah these are nice and they're not overpowering um i have another one of their coffees I forget which one i'll go check but it's like way too strong this one the hot buttered rum it's good and i liked it for a while but clearly i have quite a quite a few left because it's just like so overpowering but i've been liking this one it's a little more subtle and this one i feel like there's hardly any caffeine and i always feel really bleh afterwards but this one like perks me at the perfect amount i don't know what the difference is but it's great Pop you in there, little guy. One more for the road, huh? I have to bring out my snow boots because there's snow all over the driveway. I forgot I had to brush off my car. Damn it. I thought I wasn't going to wear this flannel again, but I am. And I don't know how to fix this mirror. I used to be able to, like, make it a flattering... I used to be able to make it a flattering angle. But, yes, I'm wearing a flannel again. Oops, this looks festive though. My mom has this same shirt. I hope I don't show up and she has the same one because that'd be weird. <laughs> So since I haven't vlogged in a while, I have to catch you guys up. I've been switching between CDs in my car of Fall Out Boy, Under the Cork Tree, so it was $4 at Target. It's so good though. And there's so many songs on it, 13. Wow, I saw them a little over a week ago. Oh my God, I can't even talk about it. It was like the most amazing experience. I'm not over it. Um, so I put this back in because I had just seen them and I wanted to hear their older stuff so they didn't play 
early. I think I only played two things off of this. Sugar We're Going Down and Dance Dance, which were like the big songs off that album that everyone knows. And then I've been switching to, I'll be enough, All Time Low, Last Young Renegade. I didn't even know they came out with an album in 2017. It's kind of short, there's only 10 songs, but I've actually really been enjoying it. I didn't like their last album. This was my favorite band, like all throughout high school. Oh my God, the memories. Um, and their newer stuff's been kind of weird and more poppy than I would like, but this one I actually really like. So I'm gonna pop this back in while the songs are really gorgeous. Played this when I went home for Thanksgiving. Thanksgiving. So now I like associate it with going home. I don't know. It's really good. It's fun to sing along to. So yeah, there's only like one song I really skip on this because it's a little too slow and sad. But other than that, I really, it's, it's pretty good. Oh, What'd you get? No, we need to, the unknown, mom. It's a mystery. I have a jungle memory Memory foam. There you go, Ryan. It's for your memory. It helps your memory, you know? Yeah. Oh. Oh, nice. What at? What at? Run! 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 Oh, look at the beard on that Santa. Oh man, it's going to take five years to get that. Oh my goodness. And it curls it's up. so pretty. Oh, it's out of cactus. Yes. Mm hmm. Oh, I'm getting Did you get pictures. that Santa beard with the beard? <laughs> oh, here's a Santa. That's a We can park and. Well, we saw one already when we got lost on Thanksgiving. <laughs> True. That was fun. Just think, last year we were going to this party and I was telling people I was thinking about grad school and then 10 of them jumped down my throat at once saying do it now do it and now I get to go back and be like hey guess what I'm halfway done with grad school thanks guys good suggestion good tip you just cut off with the line. isn't that a cool thought yep that is cool yeah she's looking at so me weird because I'm to talk about. Yeah, I do I'm full of stories okay, okay. you guys gotta get out first so I can start Christmas party oh, number two. Yeah, Here's our gifts. I'm sure she would like a donut ball, man. Who? Georgia. Can we go to Target? Yeah, we're going. We've got to get the Joanna Gaines thing. No, oh, come here. So I'm back home. This felt like the fastest weekend ever, and yet. I did so much, so actually like longest weekend ever. But my gift from the gift war was a Target gift card. <laughs> Stole it from my mom, oops. Um, but someone had brought one of these and I was gonna steal it from her, but she was like hosting the party. So you can't do that. But I really, really liked it. She said it's from the Joanna Gaines collection at Target. So I got a Target gift card. My mom loved this too. She loves Joanna Gaines so much. So we went to Target on the way home and it's so cute. Look at this galvanized metal. It's so cute. So I finally am like decorating a tiny bit and I have this centerpiece on my table and this is a Bath & Body Works candle holder. It's really cute. I haven't hauled it yet, but it has like glitter on it and I got it for free because it was like a 10 off 30 and it was a soap sale and I was already spending like, uh, like $20 on soap. So. This was, I think, like ten fifty. So really, it was free, and it's really gorgeous. It was a newer one, and then I just have Vanilla Bean Noel burning in there. Not much of it left. It smells so good, though. It's one of my all-time favorites, and I realized I have two backups. So we good, fam. And made some hot cocoa because I am freezing. I need to buy some mini marshmallows because the ones that come in the pack always melt in like five seconds. Is there dust on my camera? It looks like there's a marshmallow right there, but there's not. Um, so yeah, I need to film a candle empties, but I, I wanted to film my Q&A tonight. I had people send me questions and I was so energetic and now I'm just so tired and I just want to sit so debating whether to film. But I had been looking forward to that holiday party I went to today for so long. It was so much fun. 
and the gift tour was amazing as always as was the food all our polish food we had pierogies i actually have leftovers of green bean casserole and stuff like that which was so good and some of the leftovers of the desserts and my mom won second place for the dessert contest which I, she wasn't even going to enter and then i told her we had to because uh she, we won it last year together our cookies did and i vlogged that in my sort of vlogmas last year so yeah we got second place again